Welcome to another fabulous Kincaid auction. We're going to be in Homosassa on January the 9th. That's a Saturday. We're liquidating the estate of Thomas Carr. This is outside of his shop. There's a trailer. It's loaded with parts. That's a Thomas bus that was converted into a motorhome. That was one of his more recent projects that he was working on at the time, just before he got very seriously ill. He was active up until his late 80s. That's the inside of the bus right there. Shows the craftsmanship. He was an amazing person. The things that he could do, woodworking, all types of carpentry, and look at the finish work on that. Wow. There's a picture of the shower stall, the bathroom, and uh, all the mirrors in there, the lighting. There are the beds right there. It's not quite completed yet. Uh, not everything's done up to it yet. There's still some electrical work and some plumbing work that needs to be finished. This is inside the shop there. That just gives you an idea of some of the many hand tools that he had. He was experienced in everything from metalworking, woodworking, and fabrication. Uh, there's a forklift that we're going to be selling. There's a shot of a golf cart that we're going to have in the auction. How about that iron worker right there? And that right there is a, uh, a saw, a band saw. There's a set of rolls. There's a nice aluminum table that he had built. There's some benders underneath that table. Check out, there's just one of the many welding machines that we're going to be offering. There's a whole bunch of power tools, more of the welding machines. Got MIG, TIG, all kinds of them. There's a plasma machine in there too. That's shelving right there with all of the supplies that he had, bolts, nuts, screws, uh, lubricants, assorted bolts. That's all of the tools. His wife said every time he started on a project, he'd go buy a bunch more tools to do the job with. I believe it after looking at his shop. That's a picture of the lathe that he had. There's a workbench with his machinist tools. Another shot of the lathe. There's a grinder in there. There's machine tools, all the test equipment, what you'd find in a typical machine shop. More test tools. Wow. Just a fabulous inventory of items. That's a picture, I think, of the, that's the press brake. It's got a, it's a 12 foot with two four foot arms or 16 foot of extensions on it. A motor hoist. There's some of the saws that we're gonna be selling, the woodworking equipment. Uh, that's a picture of the planer. There's a Navinrood motor, little four horsepower. He was an avid fisherman, sportsman, right up until his death. He had uh, he had diving equipment, sporting gears. There's some electric generators. Right over there is a, a router. And there's a picture of some of his fishing tackle, some of his uh, sporting gear. There's another picture of a saw and a router table, a planer, a little band saw. Look at that wood workbench right there. Just a really nice equipment. There's a joiner, a big eight inch joiner. And uh, look at the dust collection system he had arranged in there. There's the cyclone dust collector over in the corner. It's all piped through a shop. You won't want to miss this auction. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have a lot of items in there to sell. Something for everyone. Looking forward to seeing you. Remember, that's on January the 9th at Homosassa.